do that? Are you kidding me? Yes. Finalito. Come on, what's up? Be you. Give me a second. I can see. I can see. I can see nothing. Let me see if this tablet is on. Nope. Oh yeah. All right. We got batteria. We got batteria. No, come on. All right, let me put you guys in the in the big screen over here because I cannot see nothing. If I can find the remote. Shoot, man. No, no, no. That's not it. Escape. Let me see. <laughs> and of course, I don't know how to mess with this remote. How can I get YouTube? Don't mind me, man. I'm I'm, I'm lost over here. Um. Okay, remote, tell me something. I'm gonna figure out myself, watch. Nope. That's not it. Uh, movies. Nope, that's not it. Oh, hold on. I saw something interesting here. Yeah. Nope, those are movies. Um, home. There you go. Ha! I found it. You too. Then. Ha, how I search for Caliso? Yeah. Um, back over here. Okay. Back over here is search. Then. Clear. Oh, look at Caliso right there. Caliso Riffing. Caliso Riffing supposedly live. And I found ya. I gotta celebrate. Yay. You wanna see where I found you guys? Watch this. <whistles> look at that tank. <laughs> Now, can I see the chat? That's another question. Let's see. Um, nope. Light chat. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Come on. Successfully connected. Can I see it? I want to see this. It's not letting me see it. Why not? Channel light shot. Come on, show people. 
I apologize. Give me a second, guys. I can't see what you guys are writing, like always. Type something. Let's see if it pop out on the screen. The other phone is going crazy. <sighs> searching for what? What are you searching for? What I need you to do is charge. That's what I need you to do. Stop being a mofo. The phone is just going crazy, turning on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off. Stay on. Be nice. Come on, be nice. Be nice. Be cool. That's it. Probably the connection is bad. Yeah, that's probably what it is. Let's see how you're gonna like it now. Supposedly it's turning on right now. Oh, I can see somebody, I can see somebody. Ass, what's going on, Anthony? Ha, <laughs> I can see you guys finally in the TV. Oscar! You could tell I'm home alone, huh? <laughs> Yo, that phone is going crazy. It's turning on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off. And it turned off again. What the freak? What's wrong with you, man? You was working just fine. It's turning. Yo, no lie. Look at this. Look at this. It's turning on. Now, I'm, now it's going to make me look bad. For today. Come on, my guy. For today. Tch. No. Well, on. It says it's charging. It's searching. And it's off. <laughs> Watch. One more time. Boop. Boop, on. <laughs> it's going crazy. It is going crazy. Ah. The scene, Ginger, I just found you recently. That's a great looking tank. Thank you, brother. Thank you. I hope to see you here more often, man. We here almost every day. Usually at 8 o'clock at night. And... And we finish at whatever time, depending on how, how I'm feeling that day. But we're always here, man. We're always here. Um, with the daily basis, what goes on with my reef and, and with everybody that be here in the chat. So, as of right now, we got a storm warning. It's raining outside. Not that much wind outside, so... Let me show you guys how it's looking outside. Nothing crazy. Thank God the storm moved away a little. So, nothing crazy. Just clouds, a little bit of rain. Oh, hold on. My bad. I thought I was still looking at the U. <laughs> at, the, at the blue light. Just minor winds. Nothing crazy. Thank God the storm is moving away. What's up, Phil? So I got lucky with the storm, man. It's moving away. Uh, but still, um, the storm moved away, but the tail of the storm, it might hit us in the afternoon. Around 3 o'clock, they saying. So we'll see. In the meantime, since I haven't done my maintenance, on the tank that's what i'm gonna be doing now while we're in the stream so i hope i don't bore you guys this phone is going crazy it's still doing it i don't know if rifq did something to it rifq hates this phone by the way i'm gonna try
try to because I can see everything better here um on the TV I don't know how to mess with the with the chat here at least I could go up and down you got three rocks flower name recently one stay out the other head yeah they did kind of Peaky at the beginning, but once they settle, they they be okay. I got that one that I've been trying to take it out. I spent like I put the the pointer stick, the orange stick, yesterday right on the mouth to see if I get her uncomfortable and move out of there. But nope, she get opening with no problem. So my last my last uh, results for it is gonna be is I'm gonna probably before everything closes. Um, I mean, it don't have to be today. It could be sometime this week. It's get uh, big chunks of, of shrimp and give her a nice, nice chunk. So once she, she swallows it, it can go back inside the hole because it is, is, it's full. So then there, I'm gonna try get it out without knocking <laughs> some of these sticks out of there, man. This phone is going crazy. I'm gonna try to turn it on normal and then put it on the charger and see what happened. Man, what the heck happened to this phone now? <laughs> Look, I'm trying to turn it on, watch what it does. Shows the apple and the apple, somebody steals the apple. Are you mother flower? You know I got music. I got a lot of stuff in there. You better open up. If it's doing it without me pressing a button, this phone is crazy. It's possessed. All right, no apple showing. Nope. Let's see, I'm gonna put in the charger again and see. What the heck, man? Um, shoot, and I needed to tell Rifki to go pick up uh, salt water. I had six fish in the quarantine three weeks in yesterday and all doing well. I lost her powder blue, oh man. Not sure why, no spots or anything was eating well. Maybe it was the cyanide they be putting on, 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 you know, to catch them. I heard that they died like a couple days or months later after that. The reactor is up and running, tested this morning and seems to be locked in already nice. That's the first time trying one. I heard the same. So bum, I was doing well for three weeks. Yeah. Yeah, I've been hearing a lot about some fishes the the you know we get. That some fish still are catch with cyanide, something like that. And they could do fine while they go through all the stress of transporting and, and bringing them over here, but once they settle in a tank when they can be at peace. I guess the stress don't let the cyanide, uh, something like that, I don't know, some theory like that. And then it is basically the fish is poison and later on I'm always gonna end up dying. That's crazy. That's crazy. And it's sad too, man, because you know, we buy this fish, we dedicate all our time to it, and then they die, you don't even know why. Sometimes I think it's, it's, it's that, you know, uh, they say, oh, hard to keep, they die, and we don't know why. That's, that's gotta be it. That's gotta be it. I mean, I always say, man, it's, yeah, it's, our, it's so, some picky eaters out there. 
some fish that are picky eaters. But listen, they come from the ocean. It don't get wilder than that. It don't get wilder than that. So don't come to me, the no stress in the tank and this and that. Yeah, they, they close in a, on a glass box, but they come from the ocean. They got to avoid getting eaten every single day. And you're going to, nah, come on. Come on. All you got to do is just get them to eat. That's it. Once you get them to eat, the fish will be fine. Look at this guy, what he's doing. Oh, I'm going to catch you. I'm going to catch you. At least he's nipping at, 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 at the stress coral, not at the good ones. I gotta catch that angel out of there. I don't know where I'm gonna put him, but he gotta get out. He got to get out. Wow, 65 gallons. <laughs> wow, 65 gallon water chain. Hey, whatever it takes, right? Whatever it takes. That's what I'm doing. I, I was gonna make some water and do the water change later on. But I'm gonna do some equipment maintenance first. Clean the power heads, clean the skimmer. Uh, I already test the tank, everything is good. So not to worry about no levels. The only thing I haven't checked is salinity. But everything else was on spot exactly where it was yesterday, exactly where it was the day before and the day before and the day before and the day before and before before. So everything being smooth. Like I, I could say I finally found a sweet spot in my habits with the tank and my feeding. Um, even though this fish look they, they hungry all the time. I mean, that's how fish are, but they look healthy. So as long as I don't see nobody thinning out, then they good. I'm gonna continue doing the same thing over and over and over and over. So. Everything's good. Everything is good, good, good. I bought uh, three frags yesterday. But three of them, I bought again the, uh, the Fox Flame, a nice chunk. So right here. A nice chunk for $60 right there compared to the $20 one that is over there <laughs> that's a big big difference then I bought this finally forest fire digging it's kind of light in this side because it wasn't getting no light but it still got the polyp so but finally got that green body with the red polyps or orange polyps. And I bought this little tiny little bit of thing for $20. Don't know what it is. So we'll see what it turned into. We'll see. <clears throat> but yeah, man, I was getting scared earlier. Um, well, not earlier, last night. Not scared because it's not my first rodeo going through storms and and all these issues with, with weather around this time. But it, it definitely concerned me because if we got a power outage, especially where I'm at right now, I'm more closer to the water. And I wish I had a picture of yesterday um, evacu evacuation areas they put. And we just missed it. We just missed it. So that didn't mean that the water couldn't reach over here, but we barely missed it. So that was a relief, but still it was a concern, you know, power outage. Because if, it, if it water gets all the way where I'm at or close to where I'm at, of course, we're not going to have no light. So that was... That was my worries, but thank God the storm moved away. Um, we're still gonna get some rain in the afternoon. We're still gonna get some wind gusts, so it still could be a power outage.
possibility. But I'm ready. I'm ready. Like last year, I'm ready. Well, last year I wasn't ready. <laughs> but I got myself ready. So this year we got my battery backup for the power heads. That phone's still going crazy over there. Watch. Off. Still going, and then for the car, it's a 200 watt uh, power converter. That's what it is, inverter. This thing works amazing. Connected to the lighter of the car, and you can charge your phone, and you can have three things connected, and that be return pump, one light, one power head. Tank is safe. So this is. Telling you, by far, my go-to if you don't have a generator and stuff like that. So, that thing is amazing. I live in Texas. I learned with all the tornadoes and winter storm. We have, yeah, man. <laughs> Buy a generator. Yep, I got to do that, but... Since plans are to move down to a worse place that could get more flooded is is to Florida. Um, I think I'm gonna have to buy a, a house that could float. Uh, but we'll see, we'll see. Uh, um, it's, it's, it's still in the plan, so we don't know what we're gonna do yet. So, well last year, last year the um how you call those thing on the on the poles um whatever that thing blew blow um blew up and i was without light for four days four days no light and my tank was running connected to the car for those four days everything lived then got no oxygen problems um water flow was good both tanks are connected together so that one and this one are connected together. So water got to flow to both tank. And it was good, man. It was good. It was a big relief just watching the water flowing through the filtration and all that. So the filtration don't, don't die. And what I did, since I didn't want to push it either, the, the little machine. So I just connected the light for two hours, fed the fish and all that. And... Temperature was getting a little high. I think it got all the way up to 82, 83 at one point. But everything made it. Everything made it. I didn't have no coral losses like that. I mean, in the wild, the temperature go up to 90. You know? And they and, and they still alive. So. Wow. 10 days. <laughs> wow. 10 days. I can't imagine. I can't imagine. Here, like I say, I'm. I could say if we go by blocks, I'm like a good ten blocks, fifteen blocks away from the water. But then again, blocks can be different sizes. So, but if I go by feet, I don't know either. Cause it's, it's <laughs> if I go walking. Let's see, if I go walk in, it will take me about 20 minutes, so it's not that far. It's not that far. The water is right there. Lucky you had a Kalina Barbie Mueller. Longest I had to go on it was three days. I needed to buy a bigger gen. Now that I added a bigger tank, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, I'm trying to, uh, I'm gonna get one eventually, you know, cause when power outage happened, if <laughs> the fridge is not connected, it's, it forces, you know, you don't have that much time to keep everything uh, fresh like milk meats and all that all that's gonna go bad especially if keeping it uh cold with ice especially things that need to be frozen nah all right all that food gotta go in the garbage and you gotta 
rebuy everything again. That happened to me last year. All the food that we had in the fridge had to be thrown in the garbage. Cause once the coolers we had wasn't big enough and, and two things were gonna melt. You know, anything that was frozen, melt it, and then to freeze it again, it doesn't matter if it stay cold. Once it gets unfrozen, nope, it's water in there now, and it's not gonna be good at all. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna check on that. Yeah, I got a harbor free right next to my job. <laughs> and you don't. <laughs> oh man. That's how we do, man. We right we you know how, how we be thinking we see the generator and we and we um stand in front of it and say damn four fifty one frag, two frags, three frags is why if I buy a coral pack. Um you know what? We get the pack. <laughs> That's how we are, man. That's how we are. Me and wife <clears throat> almost froze to death. It got down to 28 inside the house. Wow. Wow, that's crazy. <clears throat> that's crazy. At least, at least, you know, in, it's, it's easier to get warm. Uh, of course, if I don't get too cold, then if it's hot, get the house cold. You know, is is it works different? <clears throat> okay, okay, nice. Anthony said, "I bought a generator from Harbor Freight. Works well. Wish I had bought a larger one. I expand since I got it." When they put solar on my house, I had them installed in the air plug so I can plug generators into a house and turn on the breakers I needed. Don't have to run a bunch of, oh yeah, yeah, that's pretty nice. Hook up space heaters, but it never got up above 40 in the house. The fish stays 76, nice. Guys, you're gonna make me learn more English here now. <laughs> I like to read through the message so that way I learn better. English! Glad I don't deal with those temps. Yeah. I mean, while we're here. Oh man, did I broke that thing downstairs? Oh, no, it's here. Been slacking on my main in this week. It was supposed to get done uh, since last week. The skimmer, I was supposed to clean it last week. I didn't do it, and but because it didn't skim me a lot, so I'm I'm skimming I'm skimming like super dry, and it don't skims a lot. It, mostly everything gets stuck in the in the neck of the skimmer or in the cup. Then I, what I did, I started skimming a little wet, so all that stuff goes down, and kind of better now. But it need to get clean. The whole thing, the, the skimmer's um, chamber need to get clean, the skimmer, don't know if I should change the reactor, the phosphate reactor, because it's working fine, the phosphates are good, where are they at? I don't mind where they at, so let's see what we do. You and the wife froze, but the fish were good. Funny now, but I bet it sucked for you guys. Hope you don't have to go through that again. Yeah. No, no, I haven't get the aqua skimmer yet. I haven't get it. Uh, probably sometime, cause we're looking for a stand first for the for the tank. Once we get the 
the stand. Um, I'm thinking if I buy a brand new from Waterbox, not sure. Um, I know a lot of people say, well, you don't make it, you can make it yourself and blah, 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 blah. But, you know, I want her, uh, uh, her tank to look nice and have all the features for it, meaning the stand that goes with the tank. So I'm pretty sure those, those tank, not sure, but in the bottom, if they have uh, something to level the, 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 the stand, I'm not sure. But if they don't, you know, at least it's a nice stand. It's, it's, it's made for that. Cause I, I don't wanna go through the build, man. I don't, I don't. I done stands in the past and I'm trying to stay away from wooden stands even though they work good. The last one I did, I bought of the 40 gallon breeder stands and I started cutting and welding and, and that was better. You know, cause it's a sturdier stand and I could, you know, with the legs, I could move them up and down and level the tank. Nice, nice. But that's, that's my issue right now. Like this one right here that I got, I was thinking to do another one like this. Cause this is a 40 breeder stand. I just made a smaller. Um, Cause they don't sell this side, but since they al aluminum some type of it's day metal, cause they rust really really easy. They just powder coat it. Um, but it was easier. The space in the bottom, I like it. Look all the BS I got in there. So I was thinking to make another one like that. That way I got the legs in the bottom, and I can adjust and level the tank if I need to. Cause this house, the floor is really bad. Like really, really bad. And some places like here, that's where I got my quarantine tank. And it was about an inch different from this side. So the stand was lift up in one side about an inch. Season. And I, if I don't see you guys and I don't say hi, write something again because I'm watching through the TV now because my phone is going crazy over there in the charger. Don't want to turn on. And that's where I usually see your message and all that. And I can scroll up and down. On the reef cube guess here. And I can turn on this tablet that I got here. I mean, I don't know the password. That's why. Say so swipe to unlock, but then you got to enter a passcode. Um, let me see if I can. Nope. And yeah, I don't want to go crazy. Enter password. Nope. I enter two. I don't want to enter one more and then lock the thing. <laughs> you can take my wife, cat, and food, but don't mess with the Chevy or fish. <laughs> nice. Yeah, talking about cats, man. Last night, um, I don't care if they hear me because where, where I live is houses um, together. So it's like four houses and one wall divides the other house. So the, the people next door, they have a cat. And last night, you know, if, if it's a storm warning, bring them inside, man. Don't leave them outside. That's that's not nice. That's not nice. So three o'clock in the morning, I'm outside checking the weather and boop, cause I was like, I'm trying to get in my house. You know, of course I, I can bring it in here because rescue is allergic. But feel bad for the little guy. So we call the the owner owner of the cat because who lived next door now is her daughter. So we call the owner and I don't know, <laughs> you know, she keep putting her responsibility on her daughter instead of her taking the cat with her where she lived. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't get it. You know, your daughter got dogs. You moved out, that's your cat. Take it with you. I don't know. I don't get it. John Silva.
You got lucky, buddy. We got lucky. We got lucky, John. Not completely lucky yet, yet, but. All right, let me check my temp. 78.1. Temperatura, 78.1. I gotta catch that little guy nipping on my Montipora. Stop it! I thought you was gonna nip a one here and there, like take a piece of this one and then move to another one, but no, my guy. Stop. Be nice to in your home. Be nice in your home. Stop doing that. It's a freaking little guy, man. Can't wait to set a refuse tank, man. Can't wait. That tank is gonna be full of euphilia. I don't think he like euphilia. It's gonna have the gorgonians. I don't think he gonna nip a gorgonians. Um some softies, some zoas, and what else? And some other goody stuff. I was gonna buy a torch yesterday, but man, I'd rather buy a stick than a torch. The torch was only $60. I was gonna, and Rifki loved it, that she wanted for her tank, but I said, okay, well, you can get it now if you want to, but the tank is it's not set up. And you see the tank how it's doing is packed already, so I don't care if you want it, want it, we buy it. I, I look for a spot. I, I still got rocks that you can see around. You have a great day, got to go fight crime. <laughs> take over, take care, man. Take care. Stay safe out there. And I see you later on in the night live stream if you come by. You see, I say, let me let me get this. This is what I got when I take out my skimmer. I put in this oil pan here. <laughs> hey, they say go. Let me see what's under the hood. That's why I got an oil pan. Uh huh. You see, you put it together. You put in two and two together. You get an oil pan when you're working under the hood. Oh, here we go. I don't want to do maintenance, but I have to, but I have to. You know what? I'm going to wait for Rifki to get here. <laughs> so she can do it. She loves cleaning the skimmer. <laughs> Rifki loves cleaning this. Look, she loves cleaning the vials for testing. So I got the nitrate one here. I got all the alkalinity so you can see how many times I test It's three tests here so one in the morning and one at night and then I got the one for this morning so I got the ones from yesterday got lazy didn't clean them and then we got the phosphate here we got two in case I get lazy I don't want to clean that one I clean the other one later when I do the second one but I, I mark them so we know what we are testing for, so alkalinity. This one has a P, phosphates. But this one, since the newer one, it's only for nitrates, the same thing as this one, the API nitrates. I always keep them together. 
and the skimmer she gonna have fun cleaning that if she wants full help she don't have to I gotta rearrange a couple corals because it's getting crazy in there. You know what I need? To set up the 75 gallon. I was thinking about that yesterday hard. I say, okay, let me see. I'll be playing, um, I'll be playing chess with, with the tank, see what I'm gonna do with it. So I go, okay, if I start working on the 75, I could start running it like new. But I could always move the 40 gallon a little more close towards the TV. And I could put the 75 right here against the wall the long way, how I had it in the past. And then I could connect the 75 together with the 40. Uh -huh, you didn't think about that one, huh? And then the DNT, the DNT, the DNT, what we do with the DNT? Don't know. But most of those corals are gonna go in, in reef cues tank. Oh, she's here, don't say nothing. Can you tell me what the password on this thing without saying it loud? Thank you. Finally, we got it in. It's A. Get out. And now, where's YouTube here? Like you see me on the TV. Yeah. Well, I can see your shadow. Why, why is this saying that? Sound cancel. No, no. no YouTube in here? I believe you use I have to update that. So, boom. My laptop is right there. Yeah, it's open? Yeah. Do I only need a password to open it? Maybe one of those guests. But it's only the messages right there, right? Yeah, but I cannot scroll up and down to see what what they saying. Um. Oh, anyway, cause that other phone. Do you do something to it? Just got it turned on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off. It went crazy. Mm -hmm. Let's see now, but. No, it's not even charged at all. That's why you gotta give it a minute before it isn't. But I can't hear so. Right now it says it's charging. And why do I have to do something this way? Oh, now it's working. Shh. Now it's working. 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 But you could look at the stream earlier. It was going up. It was turning off and on. Off and on. They didn't do nothing. Just throw it out. Look. This is where I see my chat. I'll buy you another one. They'll buy me another one, then I'll throw it up. You can use mine when I get rid of it. Okay, so I'll use yours when you get rid of it. So, when you buy me. Alright, let me see if I miss anybody today. What? Saying ginger, I know I say hi. Came with that. Mm -hmm. I, I know you was gonna come back with a bag. It's food. I mean, so I'm saying Anthony. John Silva, season. Oh, you a, you a Molina fan. I'm what? The best. I guess so, Lita. I was 
Okay. I know you told everybody what you did last night. What I did last night. estado comiendo de todo yo sabía que él, que él come pero no sabía que iba a ser abusador así tampoco oh look at this guy look what Rifki just bought me suck it show you guys stuff my mom will just call him so we could look at things a little better. Even though I got the magnifying on the on the lens. But I could look at them a little better. You know why I got it? Because I'm going to inspect this corals real good. I'm trying to see if I can see anything else in there. Because I don't, I don't get it why. Estoy en el live. No te puedo contestar. No es eso que dejó la gente pegada en el live. No, él empezó a cantar en 10 minutos. Yeah. You need a favor. What she needs. ¿Cuál es el favor de hoy? en el live ahora mismo no puedo. ¿A qué hora? ¿A qué hora es? Cualquier Mira que tenía que esperar porque ahora mismo yo estoy limpiando la pecera. No. Coño, ¿cómo? ¿Cómo? This is crazy. In the middle of a freaking storm, and they want us to to to. We don't go to the street un, unless it's an emergency. That's not an emergency.
Hold on a second, guys. I'm waiting to see what the freaking excuses these people have. ¿A dónde es eso? Give me one second, guys. One second. Check this out. <laughs> Ay, padre. Like, okay, you want me to do the paper for you, but why don't you come with me? Exacto. ¿Por qué tienen que mandar a Ricky? Come on, man. I, I don't... Uh, ven acá, ven acá, ven acá. Explain to me... ¿Dónde hay que llevar el carro? Right there by Forbes. Forbes, ¿dónde? That's right there, um, Fireside, right there. La, right? la C50? Yeah. La 49? That's or the one. Whatever. Around there. So, entonces, ¿y por qué Ricky tiene que ir? Porque ella no se puede montar en el carro. That's what I'm saying. That's what I want to know. Exacto, so, ¿por qué ella va a mandar a Ricky? No entiendo, no entiendo cuál es el plan de ella. Riquín, primeramente Riquín no tiene licencia. Exacto. Si lo pagan o algo, porque es una cosa. Y Riquín no está con la mente para estar guiando un carro así y menos montando esa en el Hawaii, no, porque no, me imagino no. que sea mi local. I don't, I don't like going local. I take the highway, hurry up and do that. Yo tengo mi brazo malo, so I go because so my no. Yeah, pero esa, um, esa es la mierda, no, no porque ella haya hecho un favor a uno, no tiene que estar el rapito que pido un favor haciéndolo, especialmente en un momento así como el de ahora. Like, ¿Por qué Carlos no se llevó el carro de primera? Because they say, con, la, con la parquera esa. Que no sean pendejos, que no sean pendejos porque el parking no es de ellos, el parking es público de la calle. Como mismo los demás pasan trabajo para conseguir un parking, que ellos lo pasen también. So, Lamentablemente se haya mudado la persona el mismo día o no el mismo día. Ese parking no es de ellos, ese parking es de la carretera. So she don't go to sí, she por el parking. Uh -huh. like, ¿Qué clase de cosa estúpida es esa? I don't get it, really. I don't get it. This is crazy. This is crazy. This is insane, bro. This is insane. My brother, I'm not saying that he's not capable of, but my brother has mental problems. He's a schizophrenic. I don't... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Anyways. Huh? Pues claro, pues esa es la idea. Dale, dile. Ella lo que no quiere es. Oíste. Ella lo que no quiere es dejar a Ricky solo en la casa. En lo que ella va a hacer. En lo, en lo que es esto. Es esto lo que ella es esto. No, porque se monta en el carro y que deje de estar preocupando a por Ricky. Porque es porque a Ricky le pase algo en un carro. A que se vaya a hacer la estupidez que hace todos los días y va a meterse a drogar. O robarle dinero o hacer lo que hace. 
This is crazy. My 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 bad, brothers. My bad. <laughs> I just get agitated. Family, family. <laughs> huh? Yeah. If if it's not how you how you will say that in English. If it's not John. If it's not John, it's Peter. <laughs> That sounds good in English. If it's not John, it's Peter. And if it's not Peter, it's Walter. It's Walter. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is crazy. Mr. DK! My brother, too. Check this out. Where is this storm? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, babe, you just got here, too. You shouldn't even answer that phone call. But then if it's an emergency... I know, that's why I... Ugh. Sorry. It, it, the road is bad. And a highway. Yeah, I got him pounded right now with the storm, Mr. DKH. That is bad. I mean, this is the wind got to be bad mm -hmm. on the highway. Okay, that, that's why I didn't get easy. And you're going to tell mommy que cuando el estúpido de Carlos vaya a hacer cosas así, que se lleve el carro, que deje estar preocupándose de parking. He's not, he don't own the parking. Por más que ellos quieran save that parking in the street, he don't own the street. Not because you live in front of, uh, not because it's in front of your house. That means you could be parking there for 10 freaking years. If somebody next door and move work. in and, and, and that parking is available, they got all the rights to it's get that parking. It's not like here. Everybody exactly. A it's a, it's a private parking. Exactly. Sadly, that's how it is in the ghetto or in, 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 in neighborhoods like that. Sadly. I'm really not watching. <laughs> What's going on, people? I'm sorry, man. <laughs> but right, guys? It's, it's, it's the sad truth. If you live in a house or it's a, 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 a public area and you've been there, let's say, 25 years, and all those 25 years you've been parking exactly in front of your house for all those 25 years, Somebody next door that is new moved in. That parking is available. They got all the rights to use that parking because you don't own that spot. It's a public parking. It's the street parking. It don't say the front of the house is assigned to this house. No, you can park anywhere. If, if, and sadly, and this is how it be happening too, some people have the handicap, they request a handicap parking in front of the house. And if somebody with a handicap sign park in that place because you're not there, they got all the rights to use it. Now, now you gotta wait until that person move. Cause they had a handicap. Sadly, that's how it works. Yeah, the, the thing is, where we live at, like, is the house are next to each other. You don't got no driveway. Well, not where I'm at, but where my mother lives right now. And that's how it is, man. They got to... So sometimes she don't go to church, so she don't move the car, so nobody park in that spot. Um, my brother go to work and have my mom bring him to work. So only one spot is available, if anything. Like, that, like you can live like that. If somebody takes the park and then park somewhere else. But guess what? Every time we go over there, we always find parking. Like, I don't get it. When we go visit, we always find a parking. It's crazy, man. It's just crazy. 
Ain't that crazy? Here where I'm at, it's a private parking. I, you got to come in through that driveway and everybody has their own parking outside. We have two and we get two parking. So the gold one and the Acura is our parking. We get temporary parks a car right there, but you got to be mindful of the neighbors. You know, this is a, nobody can take those parking. If somebody take the parking, we fight it. Theory. <laughs> That's the difference, man. That's the freaking difference. Oh, when you live in the streets. Well, now I live in the street, but you live in, in low, I don't know how to say it, brother. Sure, right? right? Look, look at look at insane. Insane where he lives, sometimes they take the parking when he parks, and he can say nothing about it. Is is the sad truth? That's that's the situation, you know. It, it's the sad truth. And uh, now, so you, so they don't take your parking. Uh, you're not gonna. Uh, I mean, you're gonna leave your car home, and make your wife get out of her routine or stuff that she gotta do for, for nobody to take your parking. If, if they take it, they take it. Eventually, you're gonna find one. My mom, it just take things to another level. And my brother, you know, like they've been leaving the cars parked in the same spot. I don't get it, man. And it's and it's hard for them. I get it. They live in a corner, and the corner is packed with people. You know, everybody has one, two, three cars. But guess what? They have a freaking garage in the back, full of freaking garbage, that they could park one car there and one car outside. But no. They got a motorcycle, bed, butyl, a bunch of crap that they don't need, that they don't use. Cause if you, listen, 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 Linda, listen. If, if all that stuff is in there and you haven't taken it out in a year, you're never going to take it out. So just throw it out. Throw it out and be done with it. I agree. Right, maybe? <laughs> she said she agree and she's laughing. Is since I came back, we've been doing some cleaning. Right, mommy? Yeah, just love purses and shoes and, yeah. gla and glasses. You know? <laughs> she, she said, all I need is, is, is what? Uh, purses, glasses. I love purses, glasses, and shoes. And shoes. The, the rest can go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and she loved me, she said. She almost forgot, but she said it. I know. But don't, that's, I would have said no, I can't, you know, I can't. Now you say yeah, now you gotta go, or not. You're gonna get the Bible, the, the, the Quran, the Allah she Bible. She said you. I ain't going over there. I ain't going. Okay, you go get the soup. What soup? In my mother's house. I go get it, I gotta get out later than that. They're not, they're not done. They're not ready. Okay, but I'm saying I go later. I gotta get out later, remember? I know. Lefty later? Yeah. Okay. Left hand. Yeah. You know okay. you like going out to the streets. But not like this. So what I have to do in my room, I'm doing it. Turn You don't gotta do it now. I can't break. No, 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 no. What a key. The room, no. The, you, you're gonna help me clean the tank to it. Say who? I say the you gotta clean. The devil is this. a liar. You gotta clean the skimmer. The devil is a liar. You, you gotta clean the skimmer, the power head. You say you love whoa, cleaning. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. <laughs> you say you love cleaning those stuff. I'll clean and you go buy me throw your world. <laughs> they close today. No, they're not. It's there. I I, I, I check. And they say it's closed. Let me get my soda. I put it in the. Oh, I forgot. I put it in the freezer.
seven blocks away, right? Yes, I used to park and ten you, blocks. You couldn't complain about it? In Brooklyn. Yeah. That's crazy. Six, seven blocks away. Yep. But you, have, you know, I, it, times that I went, times that I went to, to New York, it was like yeah, that. Yeah. We gotta park away. Like far. And walk. I love soda, man. Oh. Nah, Riff could be okay. She loves driving. She do <laughs> that for a living. She drives the school bus 20 something years already. 18 to 20 years already or more. So that's what she do for a living. You and Pepsi, yeah. I'm gonna I'm call Pepsi and, and we gotta we gotta work something. We gotta work something. So I could put a logo here. the new piece there it's a huge frag man hey compared to this little tiny dini one twenty dollars sixty dollars and they had a bigger one i just liked this one because of the branches they had they had two long branches um and then they had another ni nicer one but i liked this one Catch this little guy right here, Punky Brewster. Going, yeah, man. 
Yeah, it started to rain a little bit more breeze now outside. Oh, she turned on the fan. That's that noise. Let's see. Yep. What? I'm gonna turn on the AC. I gotta start moving, man. I, I, I've been like that since I don't know why. I cannot just get like a, a, a jump start and start doing something here. Because since yesterday, I've said, okay, I'm gonna start doing that. I'm gonna start doing this, and then I'm gonna do that, and I don't do, sh I don't do crap. It's just the weather, man. The weather is more to relax. We got out here, you see, all this wind movement and now it's starting to blow. Let me see if I see the cat. Meow. Not that bad. The good thing here is I don't got no trees, no power line. The only power line is that one right there. And that one is not that I don't I don't think that one has to do with electricity. Cause last time it was on the floor. Probably does. It does have to do the one with the little little ball, whatever that thing is, the connection. Well, the owners of this place, man, they don't take care of this stuff. We was the one that cut all that yesterday. The people that do landscaping here, they came last time. I don't know when, but they did all that and left the bags full of leaves and stuff there. That's been there since, she said, like a year ago. All right, come on. We was cutting this stuff yesterday. We forgot to clean that one. That that ain't ours. That next door. But you see, all the houses are together. That line divides all the house. This line here divides all the house. We got the yellow one. We got to paint this thing. This thing is ugly. All right, let, let, let's keep it moving. Let's clean the skimmer. Let's do that one at least. <laughs> at least. Um, let me see where I'm going to put you guys until I disconnect this thing. Oh, right here. Right there. <laughs> the heck, wow. I got you guys in the big screen too. Look, got you guys right there. Rescue been doing that when I'm doing the live. All right, 
The skimmer is this one right here. Skimmer is off. Remove the cup. And disconnect the cup. First, I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna put this thing in the bubble trapper so I can catch all the detritus. All the detritus don't blow back in the tank. So, boom. the lens out. I apologize. I ain't gonna try to catch this little guy today, man. I'm gonna leave the trap in there until I catch him. Watch. I'm gonna catch him. Watch. He ain't gonna escape no more. I'm gonna escape no more. Always try to clean as much of the trider I can with this. So I don't make a mess down here. Patience. It takes a lot of patience to do it like this. 
but the most important thing is get it done. That's it. Slowly we take out the skimmer. Thing is filthy. Skimmers out. Plug is out. All right. Angel, what's going on, Angel? What's cracky lagging? Doing maintenance in the middle of a storm. Let me clean that glass. I don't care if it goes inside the phosphate reactor, I gotta change that media too, so I'm gonna clean this whole thing today. Even though I got a new phosphate media, I'm gonna use the old one, get rid of that one first, before I change to a different one. Chilling, chilling. That's good, bro. Yeah, I'm doing the early stream today, then later on we do the other one.
I can always use a pump and pump all this thing out of here. But I like to do it like this, take my time. Observe the, the, the section, this section to see what I gotta clean. Show you guys what I was doing. I was pushing all that nasty stuff right there to that corner slowly. It's no rush, it's no need to rush a job like this. Keep my hands away from it yeah, as possible. As possible. And of course, let me get brand new day.
take care of that chamber first. Still look clean, but I think I should clean it. All right, let me move the reactor. Traders that I can get all the time. Right, where I got connect this? Where? Oh, you gotta be kidding me! I really. Put this cable through the back over there. Ah. Gotta make it easy, Hector. Easy for you, not hard. And the harder you make it, the least you're gonna clean it. And the heater is connected over here. Freak of nature. Uh. You never going fifty and up for tanks. The only reason why I will go higher is just more for stability. The less uh, dosing you gotta do. So that helps a lot on that. Like right now I'm doing 80 mils of cow water, about, I would say about 42 mils of alkalinity by soap. I know if I had a 75, I didn't have to I probably, you, you can probably cut that in half. I mean, at the 40 being a 75. So that's amazing. Cutting all that stuff in half be amazing. I don't want to, but I have to. I gotta disconnect the uh, maxi jet for the reactor and the UV. Oh, MG. I knew the time was gonna come. Cause I gotta clean, I gotta clean that. That needs to get clean. Gotta clean, change the media. Man. That's the only part I don't like about cleaning the sump. Especially, especially, and I agree 100% with John Silva, cause he has a nice, tall sump, uh, stand, and he got plenty space in the bottom to work on it. 
everything is nice and neat right now i got the the bad thing my setup here is not it's not that it's bad but i did a, a back connection for the cables i threw the cables behind those pipes in the back over there and then they go outside so now i gotta remove this wall so i can unplug the reactor and then run the cable back through there being careful with the ato which i know is is connected the right way it's not gonna go nowhere but still you gotta be careful that you don't do nothing here um but the reactor needs to get clean needs to get clean the chamber everything start doing that and uh what well, holds this controller fell in the back this is a controller for the pixie don't need to be there for nothing because i don't mess with the pixies they stay on the whole time and how you doing puppy you good you eating popo pop You gotta talk to me, my guy. If you're not feeling well, I take care of you right away. Okay, let me let me do this thing, because if I keep thinking about it, I'm not gonna do it. The problem is this controllers, I don't know where to put them. And I don't want them to fall on the floor. And the good thing I'm gonna do is I got three plugs in here so I can disconnect that reactor and never again connect it through there. So I don't have to keep doing this thing here. Wall is out. I'm gonna fix that wall too. Let's follow the cable. This one right here, this one, this one. Let's see. Yep, I got it. You feel the pain, John? <laughs> the pain I'm going through right now, man. <laughs> Taking this cable all through here. Oh. It's okay. It's okay. Slowly take it out. There we go. Come to daddy. Alright, reactor UV is off. So next time I'm just gonna connect it through here, problem solved. In the meantime, let me fix something real quick, that wall before I put all that back.
I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I gotta fix the wall. I know I never put an L shape on it. And this thing being coming off sometimes. And there's something to keep it from bending to the opposite side. Flip it around. See, multitask. Multitask. Okay. Put it there. Faster, do not poke yourself, please, with a screwdriver. This is gonna give us some type of leverage. Come on, come on, get in there. That's what she said. Get in there. Cheap now. What it, huh, of course, it was gonna come up. OMG. Whatever. That's how I'm gonna stay. At least I'm not gonna be wobbling no more. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, you're here, BK Chick. Hi, baby. Hello, it's been a while. Any new seahorses? Nah, not yet, brother. Not yet. Not yet. In the near future. took all my energy. But they 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 will come in the future, brother. It's gonna it's gonna be a little while. Let me remove the reactor before I forget. 
and I dump all that water back into the system. Damn, and I'm gonna have to empty. Wow. <laughs> And this is the moment when you realize it wasn't a good idea. fresh water in here right. I got pause leaving in here I really don't know what I removed this one. I don't think it was time, but it just so dirty, man. I just need to clean it. It just need to be clean. I cannot have them like this. So in the meantime, what I'm gonna do is so the water inside the UV don't get stacked. I connect this back and hopefully it's not gonna go. Yep, there we go. So the UV is working for now. The water inside the UV sterilizer don't get messed up. So it's dumping in there. Um, I still got to clean that pump. But the good thing I got two. So I'm gonna go grab the other one, wherever it's at. I'm gonna swap them while I clean that one. That's, that's why it's good to have two pumps of, I think of each thing, I'm gonna say. That way, while you're cleaning one, the other one is, is up and working. And this is the moment when you realize you didn't want to do this. Oh well, I gotta get it done anyway. Whether I like it or not. that wall clean it was clean to me just 
thing is a dangerous weapon. Oh, we got seven people. No, we got five people. <laughs> You gotta do your maintenance in your tank. God, listen guys, I get lazy. I ain't gonna lie, man. I've been saying that I'm gonna do this thing since last week. It was it was needed to be done last week. Um, I usually clean the equipment every month or every month and a half, depending how I see how dirty it's getting. But since the skimmer, it was getting really dirty and it's been like, oh, since I moved back over here, I think, it's when I, when I cleaned it. So it was about time. I've been here uh, almost two months, three months already. Two months. So at least, at least every, you know, the skimmer cup, I usually clean it every week. But at least every, every month, you know, keep that skimmer cup clean and then every or so, month and a half, two months, take all the skimmer, clean the whole thing, make it like new again. Um, the power heads, they're gonna get clean today, all of them. They're starting to get a little bit of chlorine algae on it. So do one at a time, take your time, then rinse them really good. Dry, hand dry them if you want, air dry them if you want, put them back, boom, do the other one, take your time, you know, there's no rush, do it at your time. The most important thing is to get them done, that's the most important thing. Get them done, make sure the tank is running the way, or, or things are running the way you need to run, and that's it, man. And that's it. That's the most important thing. Making sure your equipment is running top notch. Oh, we have backup for anything. Right now, I chose the wrong day to do this. Why? Because we're going through a storm. Right now it's raining harder. I see through the window, it, the wind is blowing a little more. So, if something happened right now, I'm left over with equipment out of the tank. And all I gotta make sure is the tank is up and running. So that, that'd be the, the, the hiccup right now if something bad like that happened. But hopefully not. I'm gonna get to clean everything and put everything back. How it's supposed to be, and and we're good. Let me check this heater here. Let me move it slowly because I want to clean the detritus underneath. Get back. Let me see how it is outside. Did she want with you? Yeah. All right. Ella peleando con Carlos. Yeah, because he got a nasty attitude. Like, we're doing you a favor. Like, damn. I told her, me and my son, I do nothing. Ella, like, sigue haciendo los favores. No mandaba la mierda. Not really arguing, but he had a nasty attitude because she called him to ask where she was to park the car. Because where he said mm -hmm. that truck wasn't there. So he got upset at home. Mm. I ain't going back outside. I don't care if the president is here. Hmm. Obama, that's my president. That's your president? Yeah. Um, I said hi in the live meeting. I did say hi. Guys, right? I did say hi. Maybe that's I said hi, school. baby. Oh, maybe that's when I was ordering my Ah, clothes. you see? You see? Talking crap. My coffee. You was what? My coffee. I was ordering my coffee. You was ordering your coffee? So you knew not making your own coffee? Yeah, now? I was ordering my coffee. Oh, you was ordering your coffee? Yeah. Oh, I was ordering my coffee. 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 Oh
I wanted oh. my cold coffee. Oh. Look, iced caramel latte, mm -hmm. almond milk, a shot of coconut, one liquid sugar. You hear that, Oscar? She ordered her coffee. Wow. I didn't want her coffee. Wow. We make coffee later. Okay. It's cold outside. Cold? Now you see. Yeah, it is cold. Sí, subió casi ahora. Si no está en, no, él, yo no lo vi salir por fuera. ¿No te contestó? No. Pero tienen los headphones puesto algo. A menos que esté atrás. Uh. <coughs> wow. Ah, you see, um, Rescue. What? The Mr. DKH heard the hello all the way up there to Massachusetts. Talking crap. <laughs> I didn't hear you. That was when I was ordering my coffee. Sorry. My fault. Yeah. You better say sorry. Hey, don't. You better say sorry. I wish um I wish Streamlab had the, the feature like like um Instagram that you could join people together in the live. That way all that we are doing maintenance we're doing it together.
This is how long I take to clean my um, skimmer section. Why? Because that's the heart of the system. It has to be top notch. This needs to be clean. Especially anything that came out, came out loose needs to be taken out of here. All the detritus, those little filter feeders. show you guys how it looks now. I should have show you guys a before and after. And I'm not done yet. This is one section. Look at how clean now it looks in there. Nice and clean, no detritus. I clean mostly all those tiny little filter feeders. Nice and clean. Nice and clean. Let's put the heater back where it goes. Right in that corner. All right. Now, my Loa. Never mind. Which, uh, tell me, I should be scared? No. No. <clears throat> um, no, don't forget I'm a barber. Well, you buy a barber. That was a good one. That was a really good one. I thought you were going to say something different. Nope, she said, do my eyebrow. <laughs> Another thing that needs to be out of here. Calibration. Calibration. And calibration. This is called the reactor. This guy needs to get out of here. Oh. No, I'm not organized for nothing. I have all the cables for the doser going in this bucket. No reason. Oh, damn. My love. What are you doing? I'm cutting my cookie. Oh, you're cutting the cookie. Never mind then. No, no, I just need your help real quick. You better out this stuff, but I got it. I got it. Hector, have you ever seen, have you ever seen ID investigations such as, I suggest you check it out, ID investigations, no, I've never seen it, but I will. ID investigations. Alright, we'll shake it up, huh? I'm putting all these dosing lines in a bag because I have them loose inside this thing here. Oh, I'm gonna need 
this out, the phosphates. What else I got in here? Don't need the ball power heads. But it's clean. I'm gonna swap it. Oh, where is this clean for this? Sometimes that's why I can't put my hands in here because I get distracted. Now what's next? Next is I got a calibrate. I'm gonna take advantage of now that I removed the skimmer and the reactor. And I'm gonna calibrate again the pH Pro. I gotta get our water to clean it. So give me one second, guys. I'm gonna show you now how I calibrate mine.
estás oyendo cosas. Are you in a line? No, babies, I'm in Connecticut. Close, we close. I'll be right back. Hold on. Yeah, we we good right now. Uh, a little bit of rain and the storm moved a little bit. It was gonna hit us straight, <laughs> like straight, but it did move. So thank God for that. Now we're gonna get kind of like the tail of it. So hopefully, you know, we don't we don't lose power. Even though I'm like, what? How 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 far away we from the water? Just a few blocks away from the water, but like last night when they show, we barely made it to the safe zone, supposedly. But we good, we good. Thank God, you know. So, perfect day to watch movies, do aquarium maintenance. Bother the wife. <laughs> Put the wife to clean the skimmer. She's not even listening. Oh. Yeah, man. It was gonna be crazy if, if Cause I'm right on the coast, right on the coast, right there. Like in the car, uh, two minute drive, I can see water. But thank God, no nah, man, thank God, thank God. So now, here doing some maintenance to the to the reef, make sure everything don't lose a heartbeat. Let me take out. All right, so pH Pro right now is saying around 8.1, 8.2. So my solution, where is it? Hold on, baby. Did you that? Why don't you just roll it? I did, but I didn't want to roll no more. Because I need to get up and do this. All right, so I got the, this is the seven. I got my pH solutions here, so I'm just gonna put it there to wet the tip. That's what she said. <laughs> oh man, I apologize, man, for all those stupid jokes. Then the blue one to wet the tip, also. I don't go crazy with the bottle, just use a little bit. Once I f I'm finished with it, I throw it out. I, I will show you guys what I'm doing right now. My love. My love. This is just a storage solution, so I don't need that because I'm not going to storage. I'm going to keep it in there. Can I get our water, please? See how I do this so I can show you guys. So I got here 
pH of 7, pH of 10, our water, our water, one to clean this one, the other one to clean the other one when I'm checking. So, I'm going to use this as a table here, this dosing container, and I put this here. And we're going to check where this color, well, this thing is. Let me see, can I, I pinched it in the back. I got to bring it closer over here. Let's check. So, pH seven. It's a, It's gonna be a little bit off. So, I don't care about a lot. I could calibrate it if I want, but I need a screwdriver. Let's wait a little bit. See how low it gets. Seven point nine. 7.9 okay so it's about one off so i'm gonna keep it out the water i'm not gonna clean it yet because i need to get the screwdriver to calibrate it it's better to be in the safe zone or we're close to where we need to be than where we're not supposed to be you know what i mean so this is the one for here let me see let me make sure Okay, so I'm just going to put this here, and I'm going to calibrate over here, so excuse me. Six, four, two, two, three. Two, one, three. At least I want to get it close to it. Right there, we're hitting seven, seven point zero. So now we're hitting, we are hitting the seven point zero mark. So that's close, all right? So now we take it out. This is gonna be garbage water now. We're gonna rinse it. Because now we're gonna do the 10. Our water. Our water is at 6.89, 91, 95. So close to seven. Not bad. Piece of neck and to dry all this real quick. And now we're gonna calibrate to 10. So let's see. Ten point nine. So you guys can see here. Almost close like this, like like the seven, you know, about nine. So it's 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 barely off, barely off. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna calibrate it to ten again. Ten o four, ten o two. zero there we go so as long as i get that reading on zero right there boom we good so now we remove it i clean it our water now we calibrate it now we see put it in the tank and let's see where we at. Let's go 
going up little by little. Eight. I love it. When I hit that eight, you already know that you're close. It's going to continue going higher, so. A4. A5. So you see, it's going to slowly, slowly going to go up until it reaches. I remember, it's water moving through there also, so. It's not going to be like a, a solid number, but it's going to give you kind of where it's at. Yep. So that was a good calibration. Ah, bravo, Hector. Bravo. <laughs> oh, man. Now, since I grabbed the salinity thing to get that screwdriver out, let's check salinity. Since I've been dumping a lot of fresh water in there. First, I got to make sure it's a zero, so... I'm gonna use the same our water I got here, even though it probably has a little thin, 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 thin. No, I gotta use fresh RO. I don't trust that water. All right, so the pH solution is done. pH solution is done. Put this away. One thing with my pH thing, I don't think it was meant to be completely all the time underwater. Um, since, well, not really. Not really because that storage solution, I bought it separately. Yeah, that's a pro. It's meant to be underwater. What I'm talking about. Let me go get some our water for my refractometer. I think we're almost done with all this stuff here. Okay, pH calibrated. Let me throw these things out before I accidentally dump them inside the tank. Yeah, I had, but the other day was all the stuff though. Anyway, hold, hold on, let me check this. Calibrate this thing. This is a tiny bit off. Pretty 
first time my my refractometer is off for just a bit. Alright, let's check here. Let's make sure my finger gets salty in here. The sweet spot 1.025 almost 26 beautiful beautiful I like the one I see it right there all right so we done with this part oh, now the part that I wasn't waiting for <laughs> gotta clean that scammer reactor Listen, Linda, Linda, if one thing I hate here is this, I'm screwing these little things here. I'm gonna swap these for, let me see, I got space for one with nuts. I'd rather, check this out how it's gonna sound, I'd rather lose a nut <laughs> than unscrew a screw. <laughs> Ah, oh, that sounded funny. I apologize for the jokes today, man. <laughs> I'd rather loosen that than I'll screw the screw. E Australia Reefer! Damn, my bad. I haven't looked at the chat. What's good, you bro? Did I say that to you already? Yeah, my bad. <laughs> I got bad jokes today, man. I guess because I didn't sleep good last night. But here, brother, doing some maintenance. We got the thing calibrated. Now it's reading 8.8, .8, the highest. So we good, we're still in range. It's gonna continue going higher and higher and higher and higher and higher and higher. So that part do not worry me. As long as we are eight. You guys saw it that it's off by but it was off by one almost. It's probably eight point one or eight point two right now. And it's really eight point eight. How can I, I'm gonna catch that mofo watch. I need to catch that mofo. Oops, sorry, Zoos. Dime, no. I need a million dollars, no. Oh, man. <laughs> I can't do that one. I just need to trade up there. I don't wanna touch it in my hand. You need to trade. Give me yeah. a second, guy.
What? Oh. oh man. Thank you guys for, for keep staying in there <laughs> waiting on me. I'm all over the place today. The storm, we're just getting a little bit of rain right now. Early it was raining harder. Let me see, I'll show you what we're dealing with over here. I gotta clean all that. Oh man, I'm not looking forward for that one. Uh, oops, let me take this lens out. So not much going on, nothing crazy. Not yet. You know one thing I hate, and not I hate, because you know, hate is a big word, but it bothers me. Why, why, if, if they giving you ahead of time a warning of a storm, why you wait for the last minute to get ready? I, I don't get it, you know. Pe like, people gotta be more mindful of, of, like right now, you hear the ambulance, you know, or, 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 or those other people working. You know, they out there for emergency. If, if a, uh, uh what do you call it a breaker goes boom and the house next next to it ca catch on fire you know a flood and stuff like that no but sometimes you hear this ambulance around my area and for people that are in the street speeding they didn't break on time and they hit somebody else bs straight bs straight bs now this freaking fire department, police department, every and their mother gotta get out to assist that emergency. While it's, it's somewhere else, and Lala Land over there, close to the water, someone else is going through a bigger emergency. Hey, people gotta be more, I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, like also, you know, like, I, I get it, you know, gas stations, they run out of gas and this and that, but you don't got to go crazy and fight for gas, you know, is, you know how many gas stations are out there? Not every one gas station, not all the gas stations are going to run out of gas. What I did yesterday, I have half a tank. We waited to the last minute, last minute meaning at nighttime. All right, now everybody's at home. Now we can go in peace, go to the gas station, fill the tank <clears throat> in an orderly manner. We go to the store, there's no, I mean, of course, you know, people that like to be stuck on the news, oh, uh, get food for five days. Um, this and that, because you might gonna be. You should have that ready at your house already. Why are you waiting for a storm to be ready? You know, like right now with all this climate change, all this thing going on, you gotta be ready. You gotta be ready. You never know. You never know, cause you don't gotta wait for a storm for. A power outage. You don't gotta wait for a storm for for an emergency. Why? Cause every day trees get old, branches are gonna fall, and they could mess up a power line, and you'll be without light. So you gotta be ready at all times. Oh shit, the door is open. Sorry. The smoke was going inside the house. I'm surprised you didn't scream. 
anyway, let's continue our journey through the storm. Aquarium maintenance. You're right, S. You're right. You're right. Like here, where we are, we, we barely get storms. We do get like lightning storms and stuff like that, but crazy, crazy storms like that, nah. But when they come, they come. <laughs> and when they come, they do damage. Because this is freaking cardboard houses, you could say. Made out of sheet rock insulation. So, but you gotta be ready, man. We got food here for days. And if we run out, we hunt a squirrel and that's it. <laughs> you know, we gotta do what we gotta do to survive. But some people, I don't know, man. Here, here, that happens a lot. People, they don't think about others and they just don't care, you know. Oh, so it's you, you punky Brewster. Oh no, you gotta get out. You gotta get out, you gotta get out. I'm gonna set the trap right now. Let me move you guys to the tripod. I gotta move you guys to the tripod because you guys gotta be witnessing everything that's gonna happen. I gotta catch that door fender. I gotta catch him, I gotta catch him. I don't care how, but I'm gonna catch him, watch. And he gonna fall in my trap. My DIY trap. And that's what I'm setting right now, right here. DIY trap. Say hello to yourself back there. You gotta set up the trap for that muffle. Um, shoot. I gotta move the stylus out of here. And veggie clip. I mean, veggie clip. He's nipping on my aggros. I just saw him. Nipping on one in the back and that's not gonna happen. That's not happening. Remove this. This is how easy I can set this trap up. Trap is in the water. I'm setting the trap. Yo, my trap were so good, but look, I already got a fish in there and it's not even set up. I got my ras. <laughs> I don't even got the door set up and I already got a fish the one in there. Ain't that crazy? That's how good that trap works. Set up the door. Hitting the door. Oh, 
So trap is set up. I'm telling you, I'd be catching fish without putting nothing in there. But I gotta catch that dwarf angel. I have to catch him. He's nipping at the acros now, and that's a no-no. That's a no-no. So, I gotta set up something here, hold on. Put you guys up here real quick. I'm gonna move this thing out of here. We're gonna put this over here. I need this brief, this space free. So I can set up the door, but the problem with the door is I don't have nothing up here to, yes I do. I'm gonna put it through here to the, to the light stand, I mean light mount. Uh, come to that thing. There we go. Let's bring the door up and up. The thing is, we need to. Nope. Go back in there. The flow of the power has keeping the door open. Here goes the rest. I gotta catch that. You know what, I'm not even gonna clean the skimmer right now and all that until I catch that fish. And I'm not even gonna put food in there. I'm not even gonna put food in there, watch. I'm gonna catch him. Even if it takes me all day. I gotta catch that fish. Just gotta get her, get, um, let them get used to the trap. Blue Damsel is in there now. You guys saw it? Not even five minutes. Already the uh, cleaner rats and the Damsel one in there. Now the yellow tank is about to go in there too. turn off one power head for now let me see if I turn off the right one I did yeah now it can work if I put it the right way I just gotta have it a little bit more to the front a little more to the front Oh, a little more to the front, or that door is just swinging in there. Ah, oh, 
Dig it out, you dummy. Stuck right here with something. And get stuck, man. You gotta work. Yellow tang is in. Without putting no fool, already got two, two fish. Three fish already in there. How amazing is that? How amazing is that? Now, one thing is once the yellow tank is in there, you don't like to come out. Oh, I gotta keep this door open. So nobody else go in there. Um, Trick is right here. Uh, come here, cable. Yellow time, get out, man. I don't want to catch you. I don't want you. I want your buddy. Lowering this door, man. Right there. Okay. That's a good one. That's a good one right there. So now. I got it. Now we wait. See how crazy, how crazy fast that trap works. Since I got a mirror in there, it just works amazing. But now this guy is not gonna want to get out of there. Get out, you punk. Try to spook them out of there with the orange stick. Get out, get out, get out, man. Out. Boo 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 Nope. With that happening, I will never catch him because he don't. He's not gonna go in there. Look, two fishes in there now.
I'm gonna let him get tired first. Whatever. Whatever. Man, he will get tired. It will come up eventually. What happened? What was that? Oh, I need it. You did it already? Mm-hmm. What do you think of the nation? Is it the one with the orange? All right, while I wait here, I'm gonna eat something before I continue. I gotta be careful I don't break my digi. Last time that's what I did. Why is that? That whenever you're trying to catch one fish, that's the one that never goes in the trap right away. <laughs> the yellow tent still in there. Yeah, oh my god. This freaking fish.
Let your right. Trying to catch that dwarf angel, man. I, I cut him just now, nipping a, at a, at an acro that I got on top. That I've been seeing a spot, kind of phony. But I thought it was, cause that spot wasn't getting light before. But nope. He's nipping at the wrong ones. Oh, my amor. Thank you for the sandwich. It was blazing. You're welcome. There's more. Get out of the freaking trap. Oh, man. This freaking guy got in the trap and he don't want to get out. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Well, who are you trying? I thought you were trying to catch him. No, I'm trying to catch the, the dwarf and you. Get out. You need to get out. Get out. There we go. You sounded like Sebastian from The Little Mermaid. Where? The crab. Oh, uh, I thought I sounded like Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I was using that so I could read. Oh, what they were saying. Yeah. Uh. I got the trigger ready. Look at where I got the trigger. Right here. That line, blah, 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 blah. Oh, hopefully, there, there goes this punk again. Look. Uh. Turn it off. Well, I eat. 78.4, but you could turn it off. He got up by himself this time. Do you see the other fire fish in that side? Oh no, I got both over here. Okay. So you try to catch this one over here? Let me put this too clean. Since I turn it off. Let me take advantage of that and put this in citric acid. So I can start cleaning one. I can clean the glass at the same time. Watch for no fish to jump out of there, please. Oh. Or for more. Okay. Where is um? Citric acid. Oh. I'm gonna wait, watch. I'm gonna catch him. He's, he already saw himself in the mirror. The yellow tank back in the trap. He's back in the trap like always. You know what? Let me get the tripod. Because I can use that top bar where they are. You know that I'm trouble, my mother already. 
Why? Because she keep getting out the live and going back in. Getting out the live and going back in. Oh. Sí. No, me no está bien. No, me tiene. No way, I got a firefish in the trap. Look, oh, don't get out so I can show people how good my trap works. Look, a firefish in the trap, and a ras in the trap, and everything else in the trap. Nobody can build better traps than me, man. Yeah. Now the goalie, oh, oh, the angel is already looking himself at the trap. I'm gonna catch him, watch. It's all, it's, it's all about time, watch. Timing, good timing, watch. Watch him. Ah. Damn, I don't want this thing to break. Give me a second, guys. It's gonna, it's gonna shut off for just a sec. Cause I gotta remove this, this cover. Attempting to reconnect. Reconnect it. We're here, we're here, don't go nowhere. We're gonna catch that mofo watch. The cleaner rats back in the trap. Wow, I can't believe even a firefish went in there. Last time we put the trap in there, nobody wanted to go in. Only the cleaner rats and the yellow rats. They don't, they seen you eating. <laughs> I moved it. I know you don't care. You don't care? Okay. So you're gonna watch my baby eat over there. I mean, Look, the firefish is gonna go back in there. He's already looking. <laughs> I, I, I wonder what, what, what the firefish is saying to the other one. Don't worry, I got this. I go in and check first. You stay back and I go in. That's exactly what they're doing and what they saying to each other. Because one is staying down low and this one is the more curious about the trap. And I don't know if you ever, if you guys ever look at, oh, this mofo again in there. I don't know if you guys ever look at, the, at their eye, but they look like a mean. When, when they mad, they look mean. And he's mad right now. I can see it in his eyes. He is pissed right now. ¿Qué pasó? Uh, okay, so the yellow tan already learned how to get in and get out. He's going back in. No. Let me move one of the lens. We don't need both lens right now. We can use only the yellow. Let me see, orange lens, much better. Much better. Yellow, no, 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 no. Stay away from the track. Give other one, give others a chance to look at their beauty in the mirror. Be nice. Trying to catch your body over there that is bothering all the corals. And you, the boss of the tank, don't do nothing about it. You gotta whip them. Oh. Ah. Right? Like, like fish you, okay, I'm the boss of the tank. If I catch you nipping out of coral, I'm going to whip you in my tail. I don't know why they don't behave that way. Watch the firefish, watch the firefish. He is, he's already know that there is another firefish in there. Oh, that was a close one. Uh, 
The good thing is, right, if he goes in, he's not going to see my hand coming over here because of that, that wall right there. The firefish is back in. Now the firefish is fighting. Ain't that crazy, guys? But it's good the other fish see the firefish in there because they, they get comfortable. Because the firefish are talking punks. They scare of anything. He's coming out up. Wow. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. <laughs> you finished? I haven't, I haven't even started the maintenance. Well, I started the maintenance, but it, it's halfway right now. We on standby. Huh? Yep. I got one power head right now ma marinating inside some citric acid. Um, yeah, it's marinating right now. And after that one is clean, then I put the other one. Once I finish with all the other power head, that I do the last one will be the the DNT, but I have an extra an extra fan. So what I do, I swap the blades. I take the blade out, put the the one from the other one and the cover, and that way is is basically new. Clean a little bit. <clears throat> excuse me. Clean a little bit in the inside, and that's it. It's clean. So once I do that. Then we move to the scammer, reactor, the hoses. I got to clean the hoses over here too. But the hoses are easy. What I got to do, do is just disconnect them. No freaking way. Good that I cash this thing now. The what? <laughs> The water is not going at all through the UV sterilizer. It is moving. I see it going up and down, but it's not going at all through the UV sterilizer because the other side is open, you dummy. So I gotta empty that UV sterilizer also. Oh man. But thank God that I cut it because now that water, even though it's moving up and down, it's probably lacking in oxygen right now. I mean, I could always clean the reactor first and connect it. it I mean, water sitting for an hour or so, it won't, it won't be that harmful. The tank has gone through worse. Right now, we don't want not a little bit of a, a, a stupid mistake of of killing something in the tank, you know? Come on, dwarf. Firefish again. And the dwarf and you're in front of the tank. A dance on there. Firefish, dance hole, yellow tan, cleaner ass. Four fish from my tank has gone in there. Four fish. And that's a DIY track. Ain't that crazy? I'm telling you, <clears throat> I'm gonna talk to a company so they can make it exactly like how I made it and call it my name. Yeah. <laughs> 
right? I'm the same way. Now, now you see what I'm doing. I get distracted. I start doing all this stuff too. I, I get distracted. And I haven't even made water to do a water change. They talking about you, babe. Yeah? Nice. Let's see what? Ahora, boy. Oh, wow. Lito. It's freaking. Look where the guy is hanging out. Bro, go to the back. I'm gonna bother the tank in this side. So you go to the back. Go back there. Hang out in the back. I'm messing around over here. I don't want you in the side. You stay out there. Don't come back over here. Bam ba dum bum 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 ba dum. Bum ba dum bum bum. And then if I come to this side, you go over there. If I mess around this side, you're supposed to go to that side. Tum 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 tum. Tum 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 tum. I know, I know I'm gonna be here all day. Okay, he's a sk skittish fish. He's not like all the other fish. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this poking stick here. You're gonna scare the stick. Go back there. What? You think you're tough? You think you're tough, boy? Oh, you're not a boy, you're a fish. I mean, I can catch the fish. I'll catch it. Even a fire fish went in there. I saw him. I bet you when you go outside, he's going to go in there. Try the the food in their truck. Give me a. Uh, right here. Eat those. Give me a. I'm still eating. Oh, what? Give me a little block from from the fridge. A block. A block oh, what? fish food. <laughs> fish. <laughs> the small ones. Yellow rice is curious. Yeah, just give me a quick. I'm gonna put it inside the thing. Alright. Put this here. Right, right, right. Stay in there. Right there. Now they're gonna go crazy. They're all hungry now. <laughs> they're all trying to eat. time is gonna help the food to come up. They hungry. Huh? Can we go get our money back for the flashlights, the batteries? Look, the yellow rats is in there now. Five fish from the tank has going in there. Come on, come on dwarf angel. I need you in there.
Get out, yellow tank. Give somebody else an opportunity to get in there. Go. Oh. Uh. It's crazy how they can smell the food. He's going. He's going. He's going. He's not done. He's going. He's going. Yeah, one well, food is coming out. The yellow tank is helping it. Yep. Now they're going to go crazy. All right, if you see the dwarf angel going in, all you gotta do is just move oh, this, yeah. yeah, and he will go. But well, what if the up tank is in there? Catch him both. I, I relieve the tank later. All I need is the dwarf angel in there. Yeah, he's curious. You see, he's standing there. They all see the food falling in there. But the yellow tank, when he he uh, moved the tail, the food come out. <laughs> the yellow rat is now back in there. No, they're in there. The red one went in there. Six fishes from that tank has gone in there. Watch the, the fire fish real quick because they don't jump. So don't close it right away. Huh? Don't close it right away. He's going in. I think he's going in. They're going crazy. They want the food. He's going to go in. Yeah, he is. Yeah. You already know the food is in there. It's gonna continue coming. Get in there, get in there. Get in there, you punk. Get in there with the gang gen. Watch how I catch him. Guys, watch how I catch him. Chip! I'm gonna catch him this time, watch. He's close. Fire fish in there. I'm gonna catch like five fishes at the same time, he's going. Get him ready, okay, he's going. I don't care if I catch fish, five fish at the same time. Go to the back, go out the door, over there in the door. He's gonna go watch. He's checking like, oh, oh, why the food is in there? Everybody's in there eating. So why are you catching him? Four fishes inside the trap. That's crazy. Why are you catching him? To remove him out of there. He's nipping at the acros. He's going back in here. He better leave my fish on. Yep. My fish it will. Because it's crowded now, so fish got places too high. If not, then we got to set up your tank next week. My mother didn't give me kisses like that. Go in, bro. You're right at the door. Get in there. He's in. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. It was almost there. He's gonna get in. He's going in. He's going in. He's gonna go in. Watch. Where's the other firefish? I don't see him. Oh. Get in. Go. Get in. Get in, puppy. Get in. 
Get in. Go ahead, Baba. Don't be scared. Be like the rest. <laughs> He's in. He's in. Get in there. Oh my God. He's, got, he's getting comfortable. He just went inside to the little thing. Boop. And got out. Come on, yellow tank. Keep, keep blowing some more food out. Keep blowing some more food out. The thing is, I got the food too high, so when he whipped the tail, mm -hmm. the food is not coming out a lot. But that's a good thing, because I don't want all that food to come out. At once. <clears throat> yes, yeah, st stay in that side, baby. So maybe he come. He goes more in this side. I know. Looking at you, right? Get in the trap. Get in the trap. Get in the trap. Get in the trap. More in. More in. He's in. Ha! I got him. I got three fishes in there. <laughs> Ah, I got him. All right, now the this the thing is to okay, um, get me. Let me remove the food first. Then anything. This is the scary part because you don't want to injure no fish. Look at that rest. He's gonna Trap is upside down. Um, give me a net. Up. All these corals fell on top of the acans. Wow. Acans are pissed right now. Well, only one. I'm sorry. But yeah, all shit them got in there. I got you. You guys can go. Hold. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's in the DNT. You better leave no fish in Yeah, Papa. Get up. Get up. And it's done. Bravo, bravo! Hector, the fish whisper. How long did it took? It, it, it only took about an hour, right? Not bad. I caught like seven fish with doing so much effort on it. 
And, oh, last time he was bothering the Mandarin. Ha! I got to catch it now from the DMT. Oh, cheat! No, oh, but it's, he only gonna be in the DNT. In the DNT is gonna be a, a pain to get him out of there. Okay, that one is worse. But, but it's a smaller tank, and he don't got acros to nip at. Um. He ain't gonna do that much damage to to corals. I'm not gonna break no corals in the process. So, ah. Thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. Thank you. <laughs> All you need is patience. <laughs> no, he, he's hiding now. <laughs> he got plenty of places to hide in the DNT. Is some other fish in there that, that could fight with him with no problem. But I need him. I need him out of here. Get him out of here. Um, worst case scenario, I could always catch the mandarin and move it to this tank. It's the, it's the same thing. All I gotta do is just shut the flow, let him eat. Um, I know it's, it's gonna be more competition for food, but I could always feed the fish in one spot and the mandarin in another, like I've been doing where he at. So. Now I could continue my maintenance. But what a freaking great stream, huh? I even drained my battery. So if the storm happened right now, I'm messed up. But it was worth it. I'm gonna put you guys right here for a while. And the other stand I got right there. I'm gonna connect you guys to the charger. And we're gonna continue. I hope we're charging. I think we are. Okay, let me clean this mess. I got a mess like always. Pants everywhere. Get all the sodas out of here. clean the vials so they ready for later for testing um, now I'm I'm more at peace right now with this fish out of here he just hiding under the rocks um, in the meantime I mean I don't want to take you guys to to clean the skimmer I know you guys don't want to see that I mean probably some Want to see different techniques? I'm cleaning skimmer. I don't got no special techniques for it. 
I do the same thing everybody does, get it all in pieces and then put it back together. I'm gonna miss the 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 angel inside this tank because he he's he has a personality. I like his personality. But I'm good. I don't need him to see like I, I got and it's not about the price of the corals because the price of the corals you guys know I don't buy nothing more than sixty dollars right now. Um but I care about the health, you know. I do care about about their their health. And if right now I'm trying to save my purple stylo and he's the one keeping us stressed out, then he gotta be out. He gotta be out of the tank. Sadly, you know, whenever I get a bigger tank where he could just hover, um, he's gonna go in in in, in Reef Kill's tank. He's going in that tank. Um, he's gonna be there together with a, with a couple damsels. So he's gonna be good. I don't know what other fish you are planning to get. But so far, she got two fishes right now. And then some more damsels. More damsels, right? Yeah. How many you want? Every cup. You can't have them all, you know what I mean? Because they're gonna, they're gonna kill each other. You gotta have one species only. Oh, well, what are those? These? Mm -hmm. So you, all you want those right there. And you're gonna have the angel fish with you, with your tank. What I gotta have him? He's bad. He's bad with corals, not with fish. So he's gonna mess up my coral. He only eats SPS corals. He don't eat soft coral, euphelia, none of that. He eats one of my corals, he's going straight to, to the, the sump. Oh, to the sump. <laughs> he's going to be punished. Oh, yeah, he's going to be back. You got nothing to do, so you good? Yeah. Yeah, here is a... Uh, that's why I'm doing things now, man, because... Um, you know, uh, I mean, I know the stream is going right now in four hours, so I probably, if I, if I continue a couple more hours, maybe two more hours, then I won't do the nighttime and spend some time with, with Rift Cube. Period. But I got to get all this stuff finished, clean the skimmer, clean all those good stuff. And it's still early, man. It's only two, two thirty-six. He said what? No, I, I do the nighttime too. I gotta do the nighttime. Relax. What time y'all get out? Well, let me know to see. Yeah. We we on a on a marathon today. We're doing aquarium maintenance marathon. We caught a fish. We clean once we part of the sump. Wow. Really? So this is my phosphate media oh, that I'm gonna use today. All this right here. It's about the same amount what I got in the in the reactor right now.
So what I'm gonna do is, once we hit four hours, I'm gonna end this stream, and then we start one later on for like an hour or so. That's it. Mommy, yeah. you resting? Oh. Okay. No, no, at all. I'm gonna start. Um, let me move this thing out of here before I get cut. So the sump is clean. All I gotta do is swap the filter pads. Where is the color for this, oh, man? Shit. the cover of that oh man I don't know where I put it now oh what of the freaking cover head ah. you put it to wash no no that's 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 the wait I'm talking about the the cover for the power head a cover a cover um. Still has seven people in the building. You're famous. The what? You're famous. <laughs> I'm not famous. I'll don't say that. Yeah. Ha, I'm the king of life. You don't say that too loud. <laughs> right, Oscar? Don't say that too loud. Then Rico get jealous. How long, how long you had your tank running for, uh, Mr. DKH? I know your tank been running for a while now. <laughs> Sarah, you're gonna start laughing. Serious man, don't tell me I'll pull that thing out, man. Where is the cover for that power head? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Back. 
¿Qué pasa ahora? ¿Cómo es que trae? No, he, he just left the job and he went. No, he he's, better go back and get him. He's going home and he's gonna go to his other job. No, no, he better go back and get him. No, 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 no. Yo, I got these special brushes to clean power heads. Amazing. Amazing. And you know where I got them? Dollar Tree. Come here, we have one coming. Hey. What's wrong? Look at all that flow. And then this one going to clean.
Hmm? You see how Amy's daughter has it? That's how I remember. Oh, that's nice. See? Okay. Well, first of all, you got to remove that one on the bottom. Mm -hmm. And no excuses. We got to just take it out. Okay. So, is that how you want it? Yeah. You can start doing it, huh? Now? Yeah. Fine, if it does the thing. If you want it done, you got to do it. Okay, but as soon as it's over and you can move, take all this stuff out of the gaveta, all that. We find a spot for that in the basement. Mm -hmm. Let me see something in there. basura que no se hace nada de esto and all this stuff I can put it in here if I need it later Y dale ella con el negro. No lo quería ver como, como el que ella tiene. ¿Ah? Yeah. Eh, exacto. So don't you look at the white one. Porque, I mean, at the black one. Porque después, eh, cuando los monte, no se te va a ver igual. Porque ya tienes el de abajo blanco.
take over the screen for your What should I talk about? Are cleaning. All the vials are clean. Now we go. We yeah, have peace. I'm missing a bottle or something to those. So now we are minus one fish in the tank. Wow, the anemone stretch like big, man. Lito refused to fall asleep. Look at that. Look at how huge that anemone stretch right now. Wow, amazing. Because there's no flow going to the other side. I don't got the power head on. Hmm? No, no, no. You good? Oh. You are good. 78.7 temperature. It's still good in range. All right, let me take those brushes. This is for the camera. Now I'm, uh, I'm moving, now I'm moving. Oh, what was that? Did I step on a fish? Nope. Okay, I'm gonna move this here.
everything is a piece of crap. Put it in a better angle. That's, this thing don't have a good angle. Alright guys, I'm going to let you guys go for a bit um, so I can continue the maintenance, let the phone charge fully the right way, that way later on we have better, uh, more battery life to continue the later stream. So I appreciate you guys being with me through all the whole thing, outside look like it's n the storm is not happening. Uh, I mean, they say around three o'clock, it was the worst time that it was gonna get, but right now it looked like it's not gonna happen. So, with well, all that being said, I guess we are safe. Knock on wood, the, it's, we are gonna be safe. So, thank you, thank you always for your support. And I'm gonna see you guys later on at eight o'clock. And remember, I probably do the giveaway today, the three pieces. And I apologize because all the storm situation, Chimp, uh, Kenny, and Mr. DKH know the post office was closed, so I couldn't send nothing to them. Uh, but definitely, I got Rifku here. She started to work next week, so I got to take advantage of that. She's sleeping. And send all the giveaways all at once so thank you so much and stay tuned for later on live stream all right have a great afternoon see you guys